the United States got military bases in almost every country. When in the history of mankind was there a nation that had had a military around the whole earth? We had to go way back to motherfucking like pre-flood or or King David. Shit, they, when World War One happened, they said that was the war, the war that is our war. Yeah, that was the that one. Was that was like the first time they used like like new type of tanks and whatever. Yeah, tank. They had yeah. tanks and uh, nerve gas. Yeah, that was the first time. But that's that's that bad. That time, then World War Two put out. World War Two made World War One look like some bullshit. And animal houses, steel, metal, stuff like that. Yeah. Before was the animal houses, like animals and shit that you use for combat. Yeah, World War One. Uh, some some countries still had that. Still the all of them. All of yeah, the Ottoman Turks were still using horses. Yeah. World War Three gonna be fought with missiles, thermonuclear missiles. Oh, they got the anthrax too. They got the anthrax with the sarin, the sarin gas, gas which is yeah, chemical warfare. They just came out with something. They said ISIS. Well, you know that set up by the CIA. And Mossad, but it, there's a report that said ISIS is encouraging uh, people to attack major United States cities with uh, uh, with fucking chemical agents. Yeah, ISIS ain't nothing against Yeah, that's, that's it. all it is. It's, yeah, because if I, why ain't ISIS attacked Israel? Right. That's all Israel. 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 And you know what? I think he likes you. Ah, oh, shit. That, that bird tried to get you. That's why they ain't scared of us, man. We know where they can come out here to get it. Get it. Yeah, he's still trying to see the bird. Yeah, that's real, though. The bird's not scared of us, is it? That's correct. Hey, right between. Oh, yeah. Because, you know, nature's intelligent. You know what I mean? Birds are actually kind of creepy. Last time, that shit, it was like a whole thing of birds and shit. That shit was peaceful. I don't know. I don't know. My cat loves birds. It's amazing. It's uh, Matthew 24. I'm reading again, but I'm reading it. It says, it's up. It says, for nation shall rise against nation and kingdom against the kingdom. And there shall be famines. You can be food. I don't see no longer. And they get first with the famines and pestilence and earthquakes in diverse places. Yeah, they're going to be cannibalism. What do you think uh, comes with famine? Cannibalism comes with famine. All these fat people out here, many, many people eating like what? Like five, six meals a day, eating all day. What you going to do when the food stops going to the stores? When, it, when there's no gasoline to put in them trucks to transport goods? They're going to invent shit to eat. Yeah, you, yeah you're going, like his brother said, you're going to invent shit to eat. You're going to be eating your own children. Be eating your best friend. They, they, they gonna be eating the elderly first. They easy to get to. Yeah, the main. Retarded. They gonna be eating dogs, cats, bats, birds. They gonna run out of pigeons. Yep. Eating your own shit. That's what's coming. They gonna be out here baking doo doo pies, pouring hot sauce on it. Donkeys. They eat the dick and everything like that. I think they were selling it too. Yeah. But there's a scripture in the Bible when somebody was selling uh, shit. Yeah. Bird, bird, selling bird shit. Yeah, selling bird, bird shit. Bird, how about, you can't even, they ain't no nutritional value of bird shit. Right, right. I'm going to get that in a minute too. You know what? Let me get that. got first. It says, there's a scripture. Selling bird shit, bro. You know shit was bad. It's that's gonna get worse. What are you gonna, cause they gonna eat all the birds. There ain't gonna be no bird shit. Well, these are the beginning of sorrows. It's the same thing that says in the book of Ezra. It's the same thing. Ezra's in the Bible. Yeah, it says, yeah, so we know Ezra is part of the, uh, the Bible. The, the book of Se uh, Ezra is prophesied to the Lord in 2 Ezra, the second chapter. There's actually prophe prophecies of Yahweh Shai, the one they call Jesus, in the book of Ezra. Call him the son of son of God. A beautiful queen. 
so, so, she's sexy. Yeah, she really is. Kings 6 and 24, and it came to pass after this <laughs> that ben had king of Syria, gathered all his hosts and went up and besieged Samaria. And there was a great famine in Samaria, and behold, they besieged it until an ass's head was sold for four score pieces of silver. Damn, four score, so four, a score is 20, right? So four score, eight, 80 pieces of silver? Hyperinflation. Yeah. Hyperinflation. I, I, a head, they eating heads. Eating a motherfucking. Can you imagine? They're gonna be eating heads out here, bro. They're gonna be four score pieces of silver. That one piece of silver was a lot. Yeah, yeah. One piece of silver was a lot. It bought you a lot. And the fourth part of a cab of dove for dung for five pieces of silver. So dung for five pieces of silver for some dung? Just think about it nowadays, like one a silver coin is worth like what? Five dollars or something? For like a quarter, it depends. A real on, silver coin? Yeah, it's about. It's a lot more than that. like a dime is like what five dollars a quarter yeah, could be like silver, ten. Silver even went up too. Yeah. Along with gold, silver went up too. But it's worth way more than a quarter does. Oh yeah, yeah, hell yeah. It's yeah. worth a lot of money. Damn, damn, yeah, definitely. So that time of this, this family we speaking of, this impact. Yeah, could you imagine? So the, how much was it for that? So fifty, at least fifty to save five, maybe even a hundred dollars for some bird shit. Right, right, right. Right, right. For some bird shit. But that, just think how it's going to be out here. Because you know the money's paper, that's going to be worthless actually. Mm -hmm. Dude in Venezuela, he needs the money so worthless or whatever. He's uh, he making, uh, like, he making uh, like, like purses and shit out of money. And then you got another video of dude making like a... Uh, making purses out of money. Yeah. That's funny though, making purses out of money. Tell me put money in. Yeah. <laughs> and they, they were just going down the street with cars and just throwing money out on the street. You know what I'm saying? Then the other video dude, uh, they were like reporters and shit. It was like, uh, I think it was, they, was, they, they were trying to buy some uh, coffee or some shit. And there was like a big ass uh, amount of money. So all this money is just for that piece of coffee or whatever. That's I think it was coffee. I forgot what it was. It's not even trash. You see they just put a, uh, they just uh, uh, try to assassinate the, uh, the, the president down there. So strong. Yeah. That was probably the CIA too. That's another sign too of what's going to happen here, man. These are elected officials, man. People will start doing that. Especially with that shit like that, uh, that Alex Jones shit. They're going to start censoring everybody. Once you start censoring everybody, they can't get on the internet or a TV or radio. They're going to start shooting. Lord, Lord willing. Yeah, he was telling me like, he was like, we should have people, when they buy groceries, they should have, should have an ID. That's market to be shit right there, ain't it? You gotta have a ID to buy, buy shit in the store. That's, you can see how they're gonna bring in that market of beast. Go back to Venezuela. Just like, I think it was like last year, they was like, I brought this out before, but they said that they were doing a fingerprint recognition to uh, keep it in the minds and shit. They don't wanna give too much food to, uh, to one person. They wanna ration the shit out, so they have to get, you gotta get your uh, fingerprints and shit in. Yeah. And make sure everybody get their biometrics. Technology advances. Technology don't stay in one spot. Keep going. Keep growing. So that's right. Man, you see just with the goddamn electric scooters everywhere. Yeah. That just started this week, didn't it? It's the first time I've seen them out here. People fl zipping by on electric scooters left and right. And you can't, they won't turn on unless what? You got the right, you got to have it in your phone or something. I don't know how it works. That's what I know. It's like Wednesday or Thursday. And now they got the bikes too, right? The bikes and the scooters. You know what I'm saying? So if you gotta register your name and everything on your phone, and you gotta use a credit card or debit card, yeah. there's something behind that shit. They getting everybody used to digital payments for sure. Yeah. Remember another article, it was like two years or one year ago. Prince, they said they wanna do the uh all five people or some shit. Because they don't wanna give their uh they don't they wanna make sure that money, that the terrorists not using money to buy shit, so they wanted everybody to check the money they buying shit. They use all kinds of excuses. All of it, everything's digital, it can't be counterfeited. We're there. Everything can be tracked, traced, everything can be taxed. 
Yeah, just think you you want once yeah once they get that uh, cash or society there, you won't even be able to sell nothing on uh, Craigslist or the yard sale or nothing. Why not everything being tracked, traced, monitored, and taxed? That's crazy. They already uh, cut down on the flea markets. On the south of flea market, I, I stopped doing flea markets because they want all your information now. They want your social. They want your vendor's license number. They want everything. It's like y'all can go fuck yourselves. I'm not doing that, bro. Try and get audited out here. Cashless society. They said countries like Sweden are almost already cast. China's already cast. There's places out west that are more headed that way. America's actually behind. Yeah, Their Americans think they're so advanced over here. Actually, this shit is not advanced at all. That's that, why their shock was going to hit them with the ball, man. <laughs> when they spring it on them, they cast society. Yep. These motherfuckers ain't going to know what to do. You know, you know America is like falling behind me other countries with technology. America was more advanced by like, what back in the 50s? It was far ahead of everybody, but now we got some of the slowest internet speeds in the world. But wait till they put all these new systems in. Trump said he wanna build up the infrastructure. Come on with it. The And everything can get more cash. You see less and less people using cash in the grocery store. Almost everybody paying with a car. And that car be taking forever sometimes too. You know, paying with cash is quick. Woo! Yeah. It's uh, Revelation 12. And uh, I'm starting at 11. It's like, yeah, 12. Yeah, 12 and 12. It says, Therefore rejoice ye heavens, and ye that dwell in them. Woe to inhabitants of the earth and of the sea. For the devil has come down unto you having great wrath, because he knoweth that he hath but a short time. They say that's why this devil's moving quick. You got your boy Trump in there moving quick, make a move. The bankers, they moving quick. That technology, you said that technology's moving quick. So then when he uh, got he like first got into the office, then he like skipped the parade or some shit, like went straight to business. Yeah, he got one straight to business. He, he, he didn't finish celebrating. He just went straight to signing papers. Whatever. They say he only sleep like, what, four, uh, five, six hours a night? <laughs> cocaine. Yeah. You know he on some shit. He got to be. He said he never drank or nothing in his life. Yeah, it was just a few couple months ago when he got out the grand deal, and now they just now starting to impose sanctions on the And you remember how shit would just take a while to finish Everything's happening fast. Now he's like in the... About in the middle of his presidency now. Moving fast. Sorry, yeah, moving fast. What's that blood move? The blood moves. The blood moves. The blood, blood moves. After that, I was just a sign to shoot the blood. That moon still was looking creepy as hell. Man, that's Sunday, man. That was looking real blood. But that old Daniel shut up the world. Filled the good people for the time of the year. Many shall run to the thing. And knowledge shall be increased. Yeah. I read that again, that bus is all loud just for the camera. Right, Daniel 12 and 4, but now when Daniel showed up the word and sealed the book even to the time of the end. Time of the end, we in the times of the end right now. Many shall run to and fro, and knowledge shall be increased. Many shall run to and fro, this is the first time in the history of the earth where you can catch a plane, bro. And you, you can be in New York one day and Hong Kong the next day. Just like that. You're done. You're done, bro. What you say? It's up to us. Nah, it ain't up to us. Man. It ain't up to us. You know about the Bible, man? You know, Fuck how, the, the people. people. Ain't got no power. Yeah, the hell the people. The people are slaves. Yeah, I say fuck the people. The hell with the, he's in power to the people. That's some bullshit. I say the hell with the people. Why would you want to give power to these people? You wanna give power to these people? Shit. Are you out of your fucking mind? Man, do you listen to what you're saying? They had power for too 
damn long. This shit ain't working. Shit, you thought, shit, you thought Esau was bad. Look, these motherfuckers getting charged. They be number lean and hookers and prostitutes and this should be all fucked up out here. Uh, Jeremiah 17 and 5 in the heading of this it says trust not in humans. It says thus saith That's said, funny the way you said that trust not in humans. Go ahead. It says thus saith Yahweh Cursed be the man that trusteth in man. Yeah, cursed be the man that trusted in man. And make your flesh his arm means that's his power. That's his, uh, his, uh, yeah, his power. Right? Make, it's that our right hand is the most high. Yeah, how about some outside? Their right hand is their right hand. It says, it says he's hard. Departed from Yahweh, but show me outside. I think I seen them bitches last night. They were loud as hell about my house. I think they were I think. It says, for he shall be like the heath in the desert and shall not see when good cometh. But shall inherit the parched places in the wilderness, and the salt land, and not have to. Blessed is the man that trusteth in Yahweh, and whose hope is Yahweh is. For he shall be as a tree planted by the waters, and that spreadeth out her roots by the river, and shall not see when her heat cometh. But her leaf shall be green, and shall not be careful in the year of drought, and it shall cease from the good fruit. The heart is deceitful above all things. The heart is deceitful above all things. People are always talking about you gotta follow your heart. But the Bible says you're not supposed to follow your heart. It says the heart is deceitful above all things. Continue. And desperately wicked. It's des know. yeah, desperately wicked. The last thing you wanna follow is your heart. What you're supposed to follow is the commandments of the Lord. You're supposed to follow these scriptures. That's why your voice that power to the people. Yeah, they thought John Lennon was a prophet. <laughs> power to the people. I would the hell with the people. The Lord gonna destroy uh, two thirds of Israel. That's what he thought about the people. They don't know how to live. Why you won't put them in control? They're immoral, backwards, degenerate. What's some more words? Filthy, foul, reprobate. Rich people the fucking what's it called? They have enough power, enough money to make every single person rich. Yeah. Yeah. The whole world to fix it. Like your boy over there saying, he said there's not enough food in the world for everybody right now. That's not even true. There's plenty of food in the world. You see how much food Kroger throws away every day? Or how much food uh, Walmart? I was watching a video on Walmart. It was just throwing away just truck tons and truck tons of food every day. <laughs> Restaurants too. Restaurants. But it, it, this country wastes so much food, bro. There's plenty to actually go around for everybody. That's why the homeless in New York is getting fat still, right? Because they go around at night to the dumpsters, right? And they get fed to the full, right? Living in the fucking gut, living in the sewers and shit. The motherfuckers be having whole homes built in the sewers, man. Like the Ninja Turtles and That's shit. That's crazy. That's real, too, man. I see that shit. They be having electricity hooked up and everything. They be living nice. Getting fat, living good. Living good, man. Out they have furniture, couches, chairs, beds, TV. Hey. That's a hustle. That's a Jake hustle. Man. They found out that you motherfuckers just wasting food. Hey. What's up, bro? Revelation 11 and 13 at the same hour was there a great earthquake. And the tenth part of the city fell. And the second woe was passed, and behold, the third woe. Oh, that's the description prophesied of World War One, World War Two, and World War Three. Now World War Three, that's coming. That's gonna be a, a thermonuclear war. The Lord gonna bring fire to America. Y'all know America's about to be destroyed, right? Y'all going to work every day, like everything is all good, ain't nothing ever going to change, it's the same shit every day. Now the Lord finna destroy America with fire, that's what's about to happen. America's already been destroyed. Oh, uh, it's about to literally, I mean right now it's just, it's definitely destroyed. Uh, it's fucked up as we speak. This is definitely destroyed, their people are destroyed. Hey, what scripture said, my people are destroyed. Let me get it.
I got it. Hosea 4 6. My people are destroyed for a lack of knowledge. Because thou hast rejected knowledge, I will also reject thee, that thou shalt be no priest to me. Seeing thou hast forgotten the law of thy God, I will also forget thy children. Oh, that's powerful though. See, because the that's why these people is destroyed. The reason everybody destroyed is because they forgot the law that their power of the Most High. They, they've, they've rejected the laws of the Most High. That's Israelites too. Israelites. Because the Lord's people is the nation of Israel. Everybody out here doing whatever what the hell they want to do. On a daily basis, we try to remove God from the Yeah, of course. That's the kingdom of Satan. Oh, I'm sorry, sir. But you know, America was founded by uh, devil worshippers. Thomas Jefferson was a devil worshipper. George Washington was a devil worshipper. George Washington is a well-known Freemason. The Freemasons, they don't worship the God of the Bible. Because America was created by Freemasons. And they had a secret demonic agenda for this country. And it's playing out just as they planned. This is all, all their plan. Well, it's actually the most highest plan. Got yeah, that's in the book of the New World Order. Yeah, oh, you look at the First Amendment, and the Constitution goes in direct opposition with the First Commandment of the Bible. The First Amendment pretty much says you can worship whatever gods you want. That's part of the New World Order, their agenda. Their yep. agenda is to get you to serve different gods, get, uh, get you to be given moralist life. Yep. You know, Thomas, the homosexuality, that's part of the Totally a ratio of morals. Turn good, bad, bad, good. What's the scripture speaking about? Turn things upside down. And what does the scripture say though? <laughs> hey, we just read the scripture say you forgot the law thy God. What does the scripture say though? If, uh, you found somebody who worshiped another uh, God and was trying to get you to worship another. Yeah, yeah 17. Yeah, and we read that one all the time. That's funny, I opened it right to it. Here you go, Deuteronomy 17 is two say, there be found among you within any of thy gates which the Lord thy power giveth thee, man or woman, man or woman, that have wrought wickedness, that have wrought wickedness. But what is wickedness, man? Well, I guess we're the only ones that know what that is, man. Really? Because really, actually, they don't know what wickedness really is. They got oh, no kill, kill a family member of theirs. Oh, yeah. You know, that's it. That's it. Just murder and thieving. That's the only wickedness. That's it. That's it. Adultery is <laughs> They have wrought wickedness in the sight of thy Lord thy power and transgression against government. Go and serve other gods and worship them, either the sun or the moon or any of the hosts of heaven which I have not. Right. All right, hold on, real quick. Even the sun and the moon. Hey, you look at the Statue of Liberty. Don't you know the Statue of Liberty is actually uh, represents the sun god uh, Helios? The Sol Invictus. That's what it's. Yeah. Oh, get out of here. He oh, said. Oh. Woo wait. And what's on the back of a dollar bill? They got the all-seeing eye of horse. That's an Egyptian god right there on the, a dollar bill. You got a, uh, the eagle on the back of the dollar bill. You know that eagle represents Jupiter, right? The false god. So America is, is not a righteous nation. That is a false description of the interpretation of the eagle. The eagle is a being from God, so. I mean, everything, but the, it's specifically named, uh, how you say, Aegitos? As Jupiter's uh, symbol was the eagle, America is the reincarnation of the Roman Empire. When the, Roman went, uh, when the Romans went into battle, they had an eagle standard. As a giant eagle, they had eagles on their shields. Their symbol was the eagle, represented Jupiter. That's a fact. So e even the, the Capitol Hill in Washington, D.C. is named after Capitol Hill in, in ancient Rome. And on Capitol Hill in ancient Rome sat the Temple of Jupiter. There ain't no getting around that. Uh, what you, you got more than that? Yeah. What was that movie called when they was trying to the old eagle? The eagle? The eagle. That's a good movie. Go watch the movie, The Eagle. It says, and it be told thee, and thou hast heard of it, and inquired diligently, and behold, it be true. And the thing certain that which, that such abominations is wrought in Israel, then shalt thou bring forth that man or that woman, which hath committed that wicked thing unto thy gates, even that man or that woman again, and shall stone them with stones. Right, so the laws of the Bible said, obviously we can't do this, we'll go to jail. But the laws of the Bible said, if you find anybody worshiping the other gods, you get all the witnesses that seen him doing it, 
Get them together and you stone them with stones until they die. Bricks. So motors. We we pick up. Yeah. Right, that's right. We were strong, stronger back then. We eat good. There wasn't no GMOs back in them days. We was picking up boulders, bro. We had. Can you imagine Samson hitting your ass with stone? You know, Samson had a part taking a stone in the tube. You know. He was a judge. Can you imagine getting hit with a brick with Samson?